What is magic? I think magic is, um, is a lot of things to a lot of people. I think to magicians, magic is mostly the emotions that a spectator feels. I think the magic lives there. What is magic for a spectator? I think it's, it's almost like that feeling of walking up the stairs in the dark and you think you're at the last step and you go to take the step but there are no more steps and you're sort of you're sort of unbalanced for a second and in that split second your whole world has just shifted everything you thought was real everything you knew was a fact as sure as you're stepping on it just disappeared i think that's magic what's your name martin nice to meet you chris what's your name again Vincent, could you just hold the phone? And I'll have Vincent stand over here, just like that, perfect, don't move. What I'm gonna do, could you turn the phone on and unlock it? Yep, perfect, leave it like that, maybe hold it like this so everybody can see with the other hand. Perfect, okay. Uh, Martin, I'm gonna ask you just to go ahead and say stop whenever. Stop. Right there? Okay, look at this card, you see that card? Yeah? All right, watch this, I'm gonna take it, watch. Okay, see that? Watch this. I'm gonna step over here, check this out. Completely gone. Look, I'm gonna pick it out of thin air, bam, just like that. You see that? You see it, right? You don't see it, but let's pretend we see it, okay? Watch this, catch this. Come here, come in closer. Look at the phone, watch. I'm gonna drop it right on here. That's it, right? That's your card? Yeah. yeah. Well, you know what you can do? Grab it, sort of take it out, take it out. Pull it out, pull it out, yeah. You're holding it, you see it? It's invisible, but you're holding it, okay? What I want you to do now is just put it in your pocket. Yeah, put it in your pocket. That's it. Now take it out of your pocket. No, really. No, really, take it out of your pocket. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Is that it? Make sure that matches. Yeah, that matches. Definitely. <laughs> you want to keep that? Yeah, you can keep this too. There you go, buddy. I don't want to see it, show it to everybody. I'm going to make that card appear on my finger. Watch this. Ah. What? Okay, um, have you guys ever seen the movie The Matrix? A low budget movie, went to DVD a few years ago. You might be familiar with it. Um, you know The Matrix, there's this guy called Morpheus, right? and he offers these two pills to, to Neo at one point, right? The red pill and the blue pill, right? Here, just come around here, Brian. Come around the back, check this out. So, we got the blue pill and we got the red pill. Um, red pill leads you down the rabbit hole, all right? You don't come out of the red pill the same. It changes you forever. And the blue pill is something we know, something's reality, right? So this is the blue pill, it's an open deck. And we have here the red pill, which is a closed deck. Which would you like, the red pill or the blue pill? Red pill, okay, hold that deck, don't open it, just leave it just like that. Could I, could I have your hand up, like this? Um, all right, I'm gonna show you two things. Two things you need to know about a sealed deck. First is the red tape that goes all the way around the front, all the way around the back, like a cigarette pack, right? And the second is the seal, that's a seal. If that's not been tampered with, you know it's not been opened. Uh, hold your hand up, please. Just leave it like that, put your other hand just on top of it. Leave it like that, you guys good friends? The best, right? Best friends ever, okay, awesome. Um, Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take this deck from you. And I'm just going to... Because I want this to be completely fair. Okay? I want you to choose any card. And literally, I don't want to feel like I'm forcing you. Just choose any card whatsoever. You got it? I, now, I don't want to see it. You can show it to the camera. I'm going to turn around. Show it to your friend. It doesn't matter. All right? Just don't show it to me. Done? Okay. Goes. That's your, that's your card? Yeah? It's back into the middle, okay? Now, what I want you to do is I want you to think of your card. 
And I want you to think of it like, um, almost like, you know when Neo just understood everything and he could like stop bullets? So I want you to imagine that you could take that card. Here, I'll leave this in your hand actually, hold that. That you can think about your card, have it disappear from that deck, lift up and appear inside the sealed deck. How amazing would that be? Okay, ready? Think about it. Can you spread through those cards? Just look for your card. Do you see it? No. Gone, right? Go. Where do you think it is? Slowly, I want you to lift up your hand and turn the deck over. Okay, wait, 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 wait. That is messed up, but let's, t let's take a second here. I mean, for that to have worked legitimately, we'd have to see if this is a blue card. I mean, if that's like a red card, then it doesn't count, right? Okay. Can you open the deck? All right, pull it all out, and oh, snap, it's a red card. Wait a second. You know what? For that card, listen, listen, for that card to travel into that box, I mean, physically, for that to be physically possible, it would have to make room, right? So maybe, maybe it pushed the red card out of the deck. So maybe, maybe that card is inside. Yeah, open it up. Go ahead and rip the sticker. Yep, yep absolutely. It was like ad cards, yeah? Yours was the nine of spades, correct? Yeah. The nine of spades. So go, go see the nine of spades. They're all in order. Whoa. Right there, no, right beside. Five, six, seven. Eight. Whoa. Oh my God, that's The nine of spades. Really Thank you, absolutely. Thanks for your time, girls. Thank you. Do you ever walk into a store and pay for something and have the exact amount of change on you? Has that ever happened to you? Once in a while. Really? Once in a while. It happens to me every day. Seriously? Absolutely. Name a number between zero and 100, any number, off the top of your head. 72, is there any reason you named 72? It's not like a year someone was born in that you know or anything? No. Okay, not a favorite number by far? No. Maybe. No. Okay, check this out. I want you to reach into my pocket. I have a bit of change in there. Just go ahead and reach in the pocket. Yep, yep, absolutely. You can leave the roll of quarters there. Bad joke, I suck at this. Okay, so count it out, how much I got? 71, what'd you say? Oh, that's not bad. One off, okay, hold on. Come here. <laughs> Hold your hands out like this. You know how hard it is to get pennies nowadays? Well, hold your hands out like this, like this, Jen. Yeah, like this, and concentrate right here. Concentrate here, you, get, you getting this, Brian? Check this out. <laughs> Where do you get pennies 72. nowadays? 72! 72. Nice! <laughs> <laughs> Sick, love it. Can I, can I see your glasses? Is that cool? Yeah. All right. These look, these look like genuine glasses. These are, these are really nice. Yeah. You pay a lot for these? Uh, yeah. They're a bit loose, eh? Yeah. Oh, bro, sorry. Here, good as new. <laughs> you know, I, I wasn't sure because I've trusted you, but at the same time, I'm like, yeah. I really Motherfucker! Hope, I really hope he knows what he's doing. That's good. It's going hard, man. One of the things I love about street magic is not knowing what's going to happen. I think I mean, I have an idea of what's gonna happen or how I'd like it to happen. Um, but you never know what's gonna happen, who's gonna, who's gonna react, um, what are they gonna say. You know, there's other people who are gonna see this, who are gonna wanna participate, so you gotta think on your feet constantly. Taking people by surprise, off guard completely, who are, who are just, going about their mundane business in their, in their normal ass life and they just, they don't expect it and it's, and it's, a, it's a fun thing to be able to give to people and at the same time, you know, it makes me feel kind of good to, uh, to be able to bring that to somebody uh, who wasn't expecting it necessarily. Uh,